Samsung and LG both have their own optimized versions of LED. One is called QLED and the other one is called NanoCell. But which one is the best? Both QLED as well as NanoCell are based on the same principle of LCD TV technology, but each uses its own specific enhancement technique with their own advantages and disadvantages. Samsung calls its technique QLED, which stands for Quantum Dot LED TV. These quantum dots are ultra small nanocrystals that are layered directly behind the LCD panel. When light shines on these nanocrystals, they illuminate in either red, green or blue. This colored light is then transmitted to the red, green or blue pixels of the screen. This way, the individual pixels are thus fed with light in their own correct color. Nanocell by LG uses nanoscale particles that are layered in front of the LCD panel. These particles operate as a light absorbing filter by removing dull colors from the image. This results in much purer reds and greens. Moreover, the transition between similar colors becomes much smoother. Both of these techniques produce lifelike colors. However, both use different panel techniques and this causes some practical differences. Samsung QLED TVs have vertical alignment panels. These VA panels have vertically aligned liquid crystals that tilt when a voltage is applied to let light pass through. The biggest benefits of these panels are deep blacks plus sufficient brightness and contrast for HDR content. The downside with these panels is that the viewing angle is limited, so colors slightly lose their luminosity when viewed at an angle. LG NanoCell TVs use in-plane switching panels. With these IPS panels, the crystals are aligned parallel. With this technique, the viewing angle is much wider. Plus, these kind of panels can handle reflections very well. Unfortunately, the blacks are not as deep and uniform with these kind of panels. Especially in a very dark room, you might get a dark gray stitch caused by the backlighting. So, which one is the best? As a general rule of thumb, you could say that QLED has a better contrast ratio and deeper blacks. For the best results, however, your viewing position should be more or less opposite of your screen. NanoCell has a wider viewing angle and is less bothered by sunlight reflections. Nevertheless, for frequent movie nights in dimmed rooms, it is the second choice. Even so, both techniques work great, and the higher you go within the model range of each brand, the smaller the differences get. Perfect. 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 And that's it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. See you! Perfect. Perfect.